Hey guys, welcome to the Animation Movies Recapped. This is David with you. Today I am going to recap a 2018 comedy creepy sweet short film called Bow. I really loved it and hope you would like to. So, let's start with the recap. In the morning, a Chinese mom is cooking a meal for breakfast. She is making bayazi for herself and her husband. While waiting for her dumpling done, the Chinese mom opens the window and looks out to take a breath. She seems not feeling good. At the same time, her steamed dumpling is done. And then she takes the steamed dumpling to eat with her husband. Her husband is about to be late for his work, so he quickly eats all the steamed dumplings and leaves to work. While she is about to eat her last dumpling, one of her dumplings comes alive, and it is crying, which causes her to be shocked. Incredibly, the dumpling starts growing up himself. So now the Chinese mom names him Bao Bao. Later, she lifts him to put on her hand and Bao starts laughing. So now, she seems happy to have Bao Bao. She treats the steamed dumpling like a child. While he is running around, Bao Bao slips and falls to the floor which caused his head to be flatted. The Chinese mom quickly takes him to the kitchen and fixes his head to turn normal, but his head is suddenly flat again. So, she quickly feeds Bao Bao and he becomes normal. The Chinese mom really loves Bao Bao. She never leaves him alone. She often takes him to market and she buys donuts for him. Meanwhile, Bao Bao is growing up a lot. One day, Bao Bao is being attacked by a dog and she quickly runs after the dog to save Bao Bao. When they get home, she bathes Bao Bao gently. Later on, Bao Bao is growing up a lot and he also gets new glasses from his mom. One day, while they are shopping, Bao Bao sees the kids playing football, so he runs after them. She quickly stops Bao Bao from leaving her. Later, while she is doing exercise, Bao Bao is playing football with the two kids. Unluckily, his head is flatted because of hitting the ball. She goes to kick the ball away and takes Bao Bao home. While they are on the bus, Bao Bao is really angry with her. However, she gives him his favorite donut, and Bao Bao still ignores her. The next day, the Chinese mom sees Bao Bao drinking beer. She is very worried and she finds out that Bao Bao is talking on the phone with someone. When he knows she is looking at his action, he quickly comes to close the door. Bao Bao is angry with her because she doesn't allow him to play with other kids, so the Chinese mom is making a lot of food to please Bao Bao. She is waiting for Bao Bao to join the meal with her, but Bao Bao ignores and leaves her alone. The Chinese mom is really angry with Bao Bao's action, and then she finished the meal alone. At the same time, Bao Bao returns home and introduces the mother to his fiance. The mother is very shocked to know all these things. A minute later, Bao Bao comes out of his room with his suitcase that he will leave home to live with her fiance, but the mother protests. She pushes his fiance out of the house. She tries to stop the dumpling boy from leaving, and in a furious rage, the mother eats him, but then she is crying over what she has done. Later, as the mother lies in bed, her husband just is looking at her by saying nothing. And then he leaves. Suddenly, she sees Bao Bao's shadow, but he is not Bao Bao. Her real son enters the room, revealing that the whole sequence was an allegorical dream. And his father urges him to talk to his mother, but she refused to talk to him. He offers his mother the same treat he once refused on the bus, which they share in an emotional moment, as he and his mother sit on the edge of her bed. Later, after getting back in touch, the son and his fiancée and his mother are making dumplings together happily. This is for today. See you soon with the recap of a new movie. Till then, stay happy and chill out.